Hello, I'm Ten Bulls to Mars. You're watching Empyreon, Experimental 12.6. I'm going to be starting on an ice planet this time. Uh, going to show you my settings here. It's easy, but mass and volume is on. CPU points is on. Um, here we go. Large planets. Cold planet. I think this is relatively new. A slow and challenging start, which means I'm probably going to put cuts into this. Just a heads up. Steer to a safe spot. Uh, no thanks. I'm just gonna steer anywhere. I'm not gonna survive wherever I am. I'm gonna have to move. Maybe I could find the hover bike. Maybe I could just crash down and find it later. I think there's a chance this takes longer in lower gravity. I'm right by the teleport station, so you know what? I'm probably near that hover bike like I want it to be. And level two already. Here we go. It is, oh, rolling away. I forgot that could happen. Let's take this out. Nice. I got myself a terrible pistol. One of these guys. Some health packs. Flashlight. I don't think I need. I think I have armor. Yes. Start with armor. Terrible motorcycle. Heater I'm definitely going to need. Portable constructor. Alright, let's get out of here. Ping. Discovered a wreckage. Discover a copper deposit. That's good. There's my hover bike. Discovered a resource over here. Let's see what we can do. Now, I'm going to have to keep moving on this planet. I'm going to have to get my temperature under control somehow. Let's check out what's in here on the way. Now, I'm, I'm pretty familiar with this game, but I'm not an expert at this game. I can't tell you, oh, that's this kind of wreckage, there's two crates inside, that kind of thing. It's a bit of seeing how it goes, you know? Learning as we go along. For example, I need to ping the thing again. That's why I can't find the hover bike. There you go. This is how much I hate the motorcycle. I'm going to try it out. It's probably going to be the last time I try it out. Even this is just a waste, you know. I could be, I could be picking vegetables on the way here. I could be getting little bits of iron and stuff. Let's see what we can find. That is a mushroom. All right. It's hard to recognize plants. They are all covered in white. Got a mushroom. Got uh, what is this? Some medicinal thing. That's natural stimulant. This is buds, which I think is medicine. And I'm lost again. Whoa. I am digging the low gravity. That was without a jetpack. Oh, wow. Yeah, pretty sure I selected planet size large. I'm not sure if that's broken or if it just applies to the starter planet. I'm not sure. Damage hover bike. And a nice large wreckage here. I skipped Robinson Protocol. Actually, I, I don't think they give you the option to start it with this ice planet start. But I'm going to guess... See, I was wrong a second ago. I do know all the, all the POS. We'll see. Something. I gotta get used to the low gravity, apparently. No, I'm hitting the wrong button. Recording brain is setting in. Got some beer. I did not get any of the other stuff I'm used to, but I guess I started with that motorcycle pistol, that kind of thing. Get rid of this pistol as soon as I can. It is 35 degrees. This hover bike is out in the middle of an open field, which is actually kind of nice. I like the look of this flat clearing here. That is a big hunk of iron. Is that new? Where is my survival tool? Got some of that. I should have grabbed some trees before coming all the way out into this clearing. It's now 8 degrees Fahrenheit. For any foreigners watching this, that is well below freezing. Obviously, I don't have any of this stuff, but I can see about making some of it. I need a uh, fuel tank and a generator to get this thing going. See if I can Frankenstein this thing up a little bit. Devices, generator, fuel tank is missing. Got a cargo box. Got these terrible ground repulsor engines that I'm going to get rid of basically immediately. And what does it take? Oh, they, they updated this thing a little bit, didn't they? Used to have that one little cargo box on top. 
that might be useful. I don't really know what I'm going to use the glass for, honestly. Not for a while. Let's see what we can do here. Don't need to dump food in. You can take that. Give me a second. I get some of my health items and stuff organized here. You can take that. Is that Robinson Protocol? I'm not sure. I don't remember starting with all that stuff. Got some nice food, some health. So I'm going to keep that here. This I don't need. Flashlight is basically trash. You can take that. Okay. The tent should keep me warm, but then, you know, as soon as I got vehicles, everything runs out of fuel. So let me fill you in. I'm going to try living off this hover bike. Makes a good mobile base. You can put a constructor on it. And obviously, I can't think and talk at the same time. Got hover bike, bits. I want some engines, but mostly I want this and this. Electronics. How come I can't do that yet? I'm going to need some bits. I'm going to need some copper. That's what I'm missing. Okay. Well, good start. Let's go find some copper. I can't pick that up. No, there we go. Take this terrible thing. Now, did I find copper yet? Yep, right at the start. And transition. Here we are. As far as you can tell, the motorcycle is not a terrible useless vehicle at all. Got a little bit of copper. I won't grab too much of this. I will get that hover bike running and wander around some. Try to see what else I can get done. I figure maybe 50 ore, and then move on, come back here when it's needed. That'll do. Get back on this godforsaken thing. How are we on other resources? So they gave me silicon and iron, that's why I was short on the copper. So I will be brave for now and assume I'm good on the rest of this stuff. And I'm basically heading straight west. Guess what? You get to skip the motorcycle scene again. Watch the temperature plummet as I come to this frozen lake bed here. Oh, planes apparently. That's what it says in the top right. Alright, unless I've made a major mistake, I am actually putting the motorcycle down for good this time. We will see. Get that out of my sight. Get some ingredients into this thing here. And see what we can do. Nice. Little generator, little fuel tank. And... I'm torn between engines and cockpits for my initial resources. Now the cockpit I want to change out because this place is cold. Uh, the engines I want to change out because honestly, these things, like, you can't even get onto the bike to work on it. Come on. So I'm probably going to start with engines. Because honestly, it's just miserable. Running over rocks, that kind of thing. Let's hit the tech tree. Let's see how many levels we have. We might have to run around picking some plants for a while. Can't do that for too long before you need to get a fridge, right? Of a vessel. I want the fridge. I have 25 points. Okay. I need RCS. I need the one by one and the small thruster. There we go. Still got 16 points left. This as soon as possible so it can get itself uh, fuel from these giant forests here. But I uh, also need a cargo container for that and the orange wood container, which is buried here under cargo boxes. So before I spend those points, let's get. Where was it? Oh yes, harvester module. Yeah, that's going to be the most reasonable thing. Oh, and a detector. Yeah. Detector, 11 points left, 7 points left. Anything else I'm going to deeply regret? I already got that. Anything I will deeply regret here. Oh yeah, the fridge. Whew, can't do it. Don't deeply regret that because we are very close to the next level. Take you, I'll take you. Don't really have enough fuel. I don't have any wood, do I? So I'll, I'll go chop some wood. Make sure I can get some biofuel for this thing to get it started. Get the, uh, do I want to place it there? 
I want to make more of a platform for this thing with the base there and the generator and stuff on this level. So I guess that would be a good starting place right behind. Well, I'm going to change the cockpit. Sorry, a lot of future planning going on in my head. This is my home right now, my Franken bike, but it hasn't been Franken yet. It's just a bike. Let's get the generator and the fuel tank and fill that up with nothing that we have. Okay. Time to go to the forest. Chop some trees. Get some XP as well while I'm here. Defense mode for tree chopping. Listen out for those terrifying noises. Make sure I don't get hypothermia. Ice planet. Ice planet fun times. You can't alt and look around unless you change the view and then you can do it. And you got so long chopping these trees. That was one of my favorite things about Rust. Uh, the multiplayer game Rust. Uh, the, the fact that you could easily look around while you're chopping a tree just heightened the paranoia so much. Actually having access to that extra information made me more paranoid. Really interesting experience. Uh, these have a lot of volume, don't they? Actually, they might have brought that down. 10 SU. Okay, we're good. Yeah, they, they were really high for a while. Let's get a few more. These go a long way getting fuel, but uh, it might be a little while before I get the harvest. So I'm going to be embarrassed if I have to walk back over here all 20 feet. I would like to camp by that constructor until I'm mobile, but, you know, I'll run out of iron, I'll run out of something. Let's get a mushroom. Hopefully I can make food out of mushrooms. I know um, anti-radiation, I want to say, comes from mushrooms. Let's get this one here. A little bit of silicon there. There's always something, right? Run around the planet looking for silicon. Wish that you would pick this up. And here we are. Let's make some fuel. That's under... I don't know. All. And then... There you go. Let's try to make ten of those. And I also wanted to... I don't know. Do some tech stuff. Let's see what's going on here. We got the generator. We got the fuel tank. I really want to replace those engines next. There you go. Let's get the heater down while we think. Nice and warm. If I want to get some more bits, get some engines and whatnot, here we go. The thing is, I can't really do all of them. It's a, it's a risky conversion. I will basically want to do all of it, so it doesn't really matter what order I make it in. It's just a lot of materials to make. I want to start with three of these and uh, four, but if I'm making that last, I'll go for... No, I'll go for a detector, and then I'll see where I actually run out of resources. Um, 46 iron, 6 and 7 of that, 37 silicon. So silicon's probably going to be the biggest problem. What's around here? Let's give it a ping. Something right over here. Let's go. I can't believe gravity is so low here. It's like being on a moon. Copper. Alright. I already found one of those. Another one ahead of me. I don't really want to walk that far. Pick up some ground rocks while I'm around. See if there's anything to hunt. Get some XP. My constructor's either going to be busy for a while, or it's just going to run out of some resource that everything uses and do nothing for me. We'll see. I've just been wandering around a bit looking for some resources, finding some magnesium-bearing rocks, which is interesting. I might have found one of these earlier. It's these big blue ones. And, uh, yeah, sun's going down. It is one degree. It's cold. Negative Celsius is kind of cold. Negative Fahrenheit is real cold, guys. We'll see. Hopefully I can at least get this bike moving without silicon. Body 
body temperature's dropping. Here we go. He's still working on fuel. Wow. Slow. Yeah, I got nothing running right now. I guess I'll go to sleep for the night. Keep nice and warm, right? Can only sleep at night. Oh, I got a minute left. We'll see. I'm not familiar with the sleep mechanic in this game. I just kind of don't use it. It's confusing, you know? Sometimes I, I... I like that there's a day counter here, you know? I like the awareness, and sometimes I like to roleplay that days are passing, that kind of thing. But when, when you involve space travel and stuff, it's kind of hard. There's no consistent passage of time when you're, when you're hopping between stars and using warp drives and stuff, so... That's a little immersion-breaking, in a weird way. I'm not picking up the copper, because uh, that's all I found while I was out. I'm gonna load down my pockets with copper. I gotta say, with the campfire and the sunset, it's a really peaceful sight. But I can't look at the campfire and use the campfire at the same time. How's this going? Well, I got some fuel. That's good. I got some bits ready to go. RCS, couple thrusters. Couple thrusters were lifted up. Awesome. Let's get in here. Let's get this ready to go. Where'd my fuel go? This is the most annoying thing. They gotta fix this inventory management. Come on. It's on my hot bar so I can't use it. Do you guys know what a hot bar is for? Cool. Fuel. Uh, is there oxygen on this thing? There's a tank. There's no oxygen. Alright. Let's turn it on. Let's lift it up. Tilt back a little bit and hop off. Shift O if I can. Well, there's no RCS. It's hard to lock in place, but eventually, you spam F enough times you can get it to stick like this. Look around for bad guys. Let's go. Uh, salvage. You. I'm scared of hitting the blocks behind it because I can't repair anything. I'm just taking my time as the hit points get low here. And I'm going to start with one front, two back, so I'm actually going to place that one here. Get a little bit more protection for the core as well while I'm at it. Let's get you there. RCS. Um, yeah, that's probably a good spot. Make it nice and pretty. Let's get uh, you replaced. I think these docking pads are just useless. Wait, I know I'm going to turn them into parts if I take them off, but... By the time I want them again, they're going to be easy to make, so I'll just take those off as well. Get you on. Salvage these guys. Alright, how's this going? Let's uh, dump my newly salvaged parts. I found a bunch of magnesium, picked up some rock just in case. This has all got to go in a fridge ASAP. I don't know what coolant is for. I guess we're going to find out. That is not perishable, but I'll probably put it in the fridge anyway. Keep my medicine separate. Alright, we got another one of these. We actually got two thrusters already. Sweet. Uh, if you replace it with the blue thrusters, the uh, blue hover thrusters. They don't do any directional stuff, so you actually need to put the thrusters on the same path. Or else keep a couple of these green things, but who wants to do that? Bam. Now I could actually level this out, get a 3 meter hover height, but there's really no point. Uh, first one's gonna go on the back. At what level? I don't wanna limit myself. I guess I'll do... this. Level. No, I'm gonna do two eventually. Let's do right behind the hover engines. Why not? We've already got an RCS on there. This is not in line. I don't want to place it one away from the reason. Yeah, there's that little corner sliver here. Trying to make me waste an engine. I see you. I don't know if I can make them all, so I'm not going to place both of them just yet in case I want to stick with one on the back. Uh, we already got a light on there? Yeah, okay. 
So a harvester box can go on an imaginary block here, and the uh, thruster should go under it. So I actually want to do that, but that's kind of unreliable, isn't it? I should make a steel block or a carbon block, whatever I can do. Nice, I got a lot of parts here. Yeah, let's throw a carbon block. I only started using these uh, experimenting in creative mode really recently. It just never occurred to me an unarmored block and then, you know, started getting all nerdy about weight distribution and stuff. Harvester on the front of that, right? And this guy, is that too low now? Yeah, I must have made a mistake. So how do I do that? Oh, I'll just, I'll just have to raise the light eventually when I get the harvester on there. That makes sense. Salvage this guy. Just put the thruster right on there. Make sure I don't do it backwards. Bam. We got front and back. Do we have two more? We have two more. All right. Can I do a third? Do I want to do a third? Kind of. I'll do that before cockpit. Cockpit's going to keep me warm. We'll see if we can do it. Where do I want these guys? Probably, let's see, center mass. For now. This is going to change as I put a constructor on and different stuff. Um, it's probably going to move further back because of the second engine on the back and a constructor. So let's take away this. Take away this. Are those carbon? I think that's a change. I think those were all steel before. design change with these circular blocks. Too bad I'm going to destroy it all. What else? We got another engine. The constructor's lying to me about its status. They do that sometimes. Yeah, the, the last engine, right? The rear engine. Sweet. So I got a rear engine. I'd like to get a fridge, but I think I skipped the technology for that. What else did I skip? You gave up on the cockpit. Okay. And yeah, I haven't unlocked the fridge. Electronics, optical fiber, so silicon. Like I expected, but guess what? This thing is moving. I think it's time to go. Can't do all that, obviously, but that's because I'm holding these parts, for one. And I got a cargo box on the uh, hover bike for another. So we'll get there. Let's put this guy on. Let's get rid of this way as well. Where do I want this? Yeah, we got a cargo box there. I might want to move, but I, I'd have to... Uh, actually salvage it. Now I already said I'm gonna raise that light and obstruct my view so I guess I could put it here because that would look kinda cool and the, and the light's gonna go in front of it anyway. Is that empty? Interesting. This is relatively cheap so maybe I'll put something else down there. I'll still put this here. Oh but I'm gonna need a block aren't I? Maybe. Yeah I'm gonna have to place it again later. Okay. I did cut down trees for a reason. Let's get another carbon block. Let's get you in here. The detector up here. And what else have I got? What was it? Nice. I'm waiting on the cockpit. Get some more silicon. Awesome. Now, can I hold all this? Do I need to rely on the cargo box a little bit? Okay. Where is my cargo box? You take all this heavy... Oh, you're full. Okay. Might dump the motorcycle. I'm not sure. Stupid thing. It's not even worth that many parts in the factory, if I remember right. I'm at 478. Okay, I should probably just make a couple more cargo boxes, right? That'd be the smart thing to do. Tech tree cargo boxes. Wait, they're unlocked. Oh, I just haven't put the steel in, of course. Take that. You make me two of these, sure. Nice. That's the smart way to do this. Where am I going to put these ones? It's 
nice, slow source of steel plates as you tear this thing apart. Yeah, until they start making it with carbon. Come on, guys. Cheaping out on me. Take these back. Take these. Uh, the different sizes of these have different volumes, so watch out for that. I like this one, but it's only 382 units. This is 500. Formerly liters, now sues. Is that where I wanted it? No, up top. Nice and weird and top heavy. Just so I can actually reach them. I don't have wireless on there. I just want to be able to walk up to it and hit F. You can take all the perishables for now. Because why not? Don't have a fridge. Don't have fridge technology. I have a core apparently. This is just trash. Along with the motorcycle, right? Inventory organization with 10 bulls to Mars, lots of fun. Let's get uh, all the constructor stuff that we can in here. It's probably going to fill up though. Yep, uh, take the stone and the wood, I guess. We'll get this sorted soon. What else is here? Nothing. I'll take you. I'll take you. And uh, it's probably time to get out of here. Find some silicon. I got a detector on this thing, which is sweet. I got a light. I got a three meter hover height. I got an hour and a half of idle time because of all that wood I chopped down. Awesome. How much thrust time do I have? I have two thrusters, right? Sweet. Just get rid of center of mass. Let's see how I did after putting those cargo boxes on. Not bad. Yeah. With the side thrusters, awesome. Yeah, this is cool. The, the redesign that they did. It's cool. Uh, detector time. Much longer range on this one. One and a half months. There you go. You got something down here. It's not so much of a slog anymore. Let's go. Oh, that's nice. I'm not tied to the ground anymore. Look at all this fuel growing out of the ground around me. Yeah, major problem is it's really cold. So I guess a, a cockpit would fix that. I don't think you need a ventilator if you have an interior cockpit, as long as there's oxygen here. So I think we're, we're good with just a cockpit. That should be relatively cheap. Silicon! Silicon ho! That sounds dirty. It's actually a historical reference, kids. Fifty feet away. All right, I'm gonna fill my pockets doing this, aren't I? Still worrying about temperature, but the next thing I gotta worry about is food. I picked up a few vegetables. It's probably not that bad. Seems like the plains and the forest are pretty full right now. But they did nerf the energy bars, which are what you get from plant protein from picking vegetables out of the ground. It's not quite as easy as just got stacks and stacks of energy bars, but it's still pretty easy. Or rather, they don't provide as much food as they used to. You can still get the stacks. How am I doing? Don't want to fill my pockets too much. 78. It's good for now. Let's get back in here. I'm cold. Uh, I don't have a constructor on this thing yet, so what's the next thing I want to do? It's probably that closed cockpit and a constructor. I'd love the constructor, but the closed cockpit is going to make me a lot more comfortable. Let's get out of these trees. Come on. Get somewhere I can watch for enemies around me at least. Put the campfire down. This will work. Don't have a fridge yet. Oh, I'm not stopping here. Just got a pistol to shoot this guy with. Hello. I might put gats on this. It makes it a little bit heavy, but it's uh, it's nice. Nice to have that overwhelming firepower against things on the ground. Minus 
47 degrees. All right, not going on to the hilltop. Let's uh, let's head south. I figure I'm close to the pole of the planet. It's late at night. No, wrong way. Oh, hello. Yeah, let's head back to the equator. That's gonna be north. Ping. Cruise control. Oh, all, it's all in the south. I think it's too cold. I'll get a closed cockpit and I'll go check out different stuff. It's cold here too. What's well, warm? Sometimes the water is warm. Oh, I'm in the mountains. That's the problem. Do I want to go back to the place I know to go warm? Not really. There's yetis here. I'm all sorts of distractible, so I really don't want to be hemmed in by mountains right now, but look at this crazy wall. Oh, that did not work. Yeah, this is too cold. It's pretty extreme right now. I, I say I got a minute left till that turns into hypothermia. Let's get out of here. Minus 70. This thing, I've barely started building this hovercraft, and it, it's, it's a little sluggish to accelerate. So I'm, I'm glad I have the two thrusters on there. All right. I'm safe here. I'm just going to put the campfire down. Let's see if I can work on a cockpit. Let's get you. Let's get some stuff. I don't know. Iron and copper. Copper. Iron, a bit of extra copper. Oh, I had some iron plate there, whatever. I'll use it. Eventually. You and you. Let's go for hover vessel bits, cockpit. Nice. What else am I missing? That that fridge. What's it take to get a fridge? Nice. You work on that. And uh, electronic steel plates. All right, I'll grab the steel plates before that starts. Bam. Let's lower this a little bit so we can work on it. Oh, I didn't think about the... Uh cockpit in terms of the, that thing. I wonder if I'll have room. I'll go for the lightweight one, probably. Let's uh, get rid of these bits on the sides. I might have to move that oxygen tank, which I don't really care about. It's a planet with oxygen. Store it in a container in oxygen form, why not? Yeah, let's just get rid of that. Make sure this works. Always make sure the constructor didn't fail for lack of some part. Yeah, all right. Got a fridge on the way too. Living easy. What do we got? Five fifty. Yeah, that's the that's the light one. Okay. Don't want to place this wrong. Calm down, drone. Okay. Before I cover it up, chance to see this from the top. We got the one hover engine in the front, RCS and core, and we got one gap to work with. Uh, if I want an oxygen tank, it could go in there. I'm probably going to want a second RCS soon. But I also don't really want stuff in the in the floor. All right, I'm hungry. Uh, I have a ration pack for sure. Building got me to level 5, that's nice. Where's my ration pack? Oh man. Yeah, that's not good. Let's grab this, get it closer to the bike, like I should have done initially. And, uh, ration pack. Nice. <laughs> grab these and do what I should have been doing, passively, which is making a bunch of these. Stamina's coming back, food is doing alright. Stamina is kind of bouncing because I have hypothermia. Hypothermia is making my hunger crash. That's not a great situation. 
But I have this now. What's the deal? Is it nice and warm? It's yes! It worked! That is nice. That's much better. Alright, get the body temperature up. Then I have bought myself some time to work out outside. Are you working on anything? A fridge. Nice. Alright. Where am I going to put that? It's in here. Oh, whoops. Don't know how I missed that. Downside of early hover bike living. Where's the fridge gonna go? Constructor has to go somewhere. Maybe three across the top there. So I'll put the fridge here. Right in front of the generator. Make the door accessible. <laughs> Because this is empty. Cool. We are once again free of the land. Which is pretty nice. Alright, I'm gonna call it an episode here. I would say that's a pretty good start. I'm Ten Bulls to Mars. Thank you for watching, guys. Hope to see you next time.